We've all seen the photos or experienced the reality of empty shelves for specific items in grocery stores over the past few weeks. Unfortunately, it's become part of the challenge as communities continue feeling the impact of coronavirus restrictions. We want to make sure that uh, all shoppers are able to obtain the foods that they need. Brian Dittmeyer is Senior Public Policy Counsel with National WIC Association. The agency is part of a big push right now, urging shoppers to be respectful and avoid stockpiling certain foods, especially on the first of the month. Be uh, mindful of folks in their neighborhood who may be accessing WIC services. WIC stands for Women, Infants and Children. It's a national program that provides healthy, nutritious grocery items for some low-income families at the beginning of the month. But there are restrictions on which products and brands those shoppers can redeem in stores. In Texas, they're typically labeled with a pink sticker like this on the shelf near the price tag. Uh, I think it's, it's extremely important to send out the message that uh, we're all in this together and that we need to take other folks' circumstances into account. Dallas Councilman Jaime Resendez and Mayor Pro Tem Adam Madrano are among local city leaders pushing a similar countywide message, asking residents to avoid shopping April 1st through 3rd unless they have a critical need, knowing there will be a surge of families searching for WIC-approved items, especially since more children are staying at home from school right now. Is there any other ask of community members that the National WIC Association may have at this time? At this point, we just want to make sure that there's adequate stock on the shelf for everyone. And the National WIC Association and city leaders believe that takes a community effort. In Dallas, I'm Damon Fernandez.